Our first week of day was our first anniversary, and we've had them every year on the the anniversary of uh, of the show. And it's a way to give back to our fans who supported us so amazingly these last four years. It's amazing. I can't even believe how incredible the response is for this show. I mean, from such a spectrum of ages and people and types of people, it's just incredible how many people are here today. Out here, you know, we can see everyone and you can see the fans singing along. Just now there was a little girl sitting on the shoulders of her dad and she was painted green and she, uh, you know, just was singing every word with, with both Annalie and myself. And, you know, we don't get that. There was um, some really fabulous Wicked costumes. I saw a lot of little Elfies and a lot of little Glindas. And then this girl had this tornado around her. I don't even know how she made it. And she was Dorothy inside the tornado. It was fabulous. She won the costume contest. It was like hands down. Popular. I'll help you be popular. You'll hang with the right cohorts. You'll be good at sports. Know the slang you've got to know. So let's start. Because you've got an awfully long way to go. Don't be offended by my frank analysis. Think of it as personality dialysis. Now that I've chosen to become a panelist, or an advisor, there's nobody wiser. Not when it comes to popular. I know about popular. And with an assist from me to be who you'll be, instead of jury who you were, are. There's nothing that can stop you from becoming popular. This year, though, we wanted to do something a little different. Instead of having these talent contests and block parties outside the Gershwin, we wanted to um, to do something to, to give back to New York in a more in a more permanent way. New York Restoration Project was founded in 1995, and for the last uh, 12 years, we have been going just great guns. We bought uh, 60 community gardens uh, a number of years ago in 1999, 1998, something like that. And as the years have gone by, we have offered sponsorships to various group, community groups and various individuals all over town. It was the people from Wicked who came to us, and it was the first Broadway show that reached out to us to give something back to the community. Our show is all about about green and that's a big symbol for us so it just felt so right to do something green for New York City and it's, I'm so admiring of Bette Midler and everything she's done so for us to be able to follow in her footsteps a little bit feels wonderful. They wanted to know what the community wanted and the community wanted all their plants saved and they wanted a, a design that wasn't too, that was you know kind of user friendly, something that the kids would really find imaginative and this is what they got. If you look down you will see the magic yellow brick road and right over here to your left is the poppies. Actually, it's to your right. These plants are the plants that have been here in this garden for many years. Um, they've been kept up and replanted. Continuing here, we have our wishing well. As you can see the sign, it's called the Friendship Garden. And again, many of these plants have been here for a very long time, and they've been replanted. And then, of course, there's, there's other plants that have been added to the garden. As you can see, there's benches for people to come and hang out, picnic tables over here. These benches and picnic tables have been here for many, many years. They have been restored and beautified. Here's a grill that they have built here, and it's actually able to be used for all the residents. There's a grate that goes over it, and people can actually barbecue. Eddie Pierce, our associate set designer, took a lot of the design elements of the Wicked set design and applied them to the garden, hence so sort of the gadgets and the, the clock-looking uh, devices here for everyone to enjoy. And um, that pretty much sums it up. So come on up to Harlem. It's on 150th Street between Broadway and Amsterdam, and it'll be open during the day for everybody to enjoy. So come on up. Is it passing? Is it passing?